off Linux in schools, we are going to be installing and playing Minecraft. Uh, and I am the educationist. My name is Nico Luhmann, and I've been an international educator now for almost 20 years. I've been using Linux since 2003-2004, and I started off with Debian, and then I got an Ubuntu Wordy Warthog and here I am using Linux as my daily driver on my desktop, on my laptop, on my server and this series is all about how you can take Linux as your main desktop and be successful with it. Now my previous episode was called installing Steam and playing games, but this now, this is something that I um, use with my students uh, daily. So how do you can get Minecraft on your machine? Well, it is almost as easy as getting Steam, but not quite. So we have to do a little bit of different things. So we are not going to um, do command line right away, but we are going to do command line later on. Um, but first of all, you just have to be going to minecraft.net and prefer Linux because that's what you want to play and then you download. So these are again, um, and here we need to know what type of a distro are we running. Um, I already own a Minecraft, so I can download it again. Um, I am running a Debian-based distro. Ubuntu is one of the Debian-based distros. I'm going to be downloading this. Now, if you want to see how to run a uh, Minecraft server, please let me know and I will make a video about that. Now the second thing then, well, what is different? So this and Chrome works uh, badly like this. I wouldn't say badly so that they do not give you a repository. You have to download the Debian package and then you need to open it. Um, either with a uh, graphical uh, user interface or you need to open it in your um, uh, with a terminal so um, up to you I'm going to show you um, how to open it with um, another I'm going to use the um, the GDB uh, package installer <laughs> And that is just going to give us, uh, it's going to check first that uh, we can um, install it. All dependencies are satisfied. Um, the reason why I use to, I, I love this uh, is to just use it so that uh, it gives me all the dependencies as well. So it just is very versatile in that sense. So here we go. Um, installing um, we can check the terminal output if we want to we don't have to and we can click automatically close after changes being successfully so then we know it's there installation complete and that is it now we could go and install let's see if we can find it right away yes we can and here it is oh that is you need to do your Mojang account yeah not Minecraft Gmail as my a son would say and then you would put in your um, your password now um, I actually don't 
play um, Minecraft through the official client anymore. Uh, what I've done is that I have started to use Minecraft on on something completely different and I'm going to show you this um, really handy really handy tool that um, gives you uh, a way of using it with um, with something that I like to uh, kind of like profiles so you can um, you can install and um, check um, what kinds of things you want to do you if you want to be installing um, something like um, Optifine if you want to have something yay okay the two games one launcher <laughs> Okay, so now I have the dungeons here as well, like and the latest release, and uh, that is my game attack PYP with Miko in Minecraft. Now, let's see. I promised you something way more cooler, and that would be. I think I already have. NC installed. Let's just double check ah it's already the newest version so i can just play multi mc oh no why not let me see oh multi mc5 okay so here we go uh, as you can see, I have already different versions. I have one with Forge. I have the latest one. Um, so this just gives me um, an ability to play Minecraft with different versions without fearing that I will break my um, installation. So this is uh, by far um, the easiest way for me to um, try mods, try different in, um, ways of playing with Minecraft and um, having lots of fun because I can then try my um, different types of um, servers, uh, different types of um, coding parts, uh, getting different versions and and so forth so this is by far um, what I like to call no hassle uh, gameplay and yeah let's get you guys into oh we're waiting um, we are uh, getting into Minecraft now so let's do this let's load up minecraft 1.16 and 5. Yay. okay um again this is indicative of my um limited hardware um but let's see maybe i can get uh, minecraft running with decent fps hopefully and you'll see that it is exactly the same as it would be in any other gaming oh it's not bad um 65 oh okay even with obs on not bad at all. All right, I need to go and get me some. Yes, I need to go and destroy a tree. I know.
that was a huge lag there. I don't know if you noticed. Alright, so collecting resources. I know I could already make the planks, open the inventory, and make me a, a wooden axe. Okay, that music is so loud. If shift, you get all the planks you want. Yay, and now I have a crafting table. Okay, where am I going to be building up my first initial base? Maybe I'm going to. Oh, this looks good. Okay, I'm going to drain this. I can start planting. This is going to be good. Alright, I can block this back. See if I can get it. Oh, no. Mistake. Rookie mistake. There we go. And now. There we go. to be here and my bed I need some find some sheep first and then I will have that 
looks perfect. Okay. Alright. Um, crafting table here. And <coughs> excuse me. Ooh, what am I doing? So I need my sticks first. And then I can make my... So there's my pickaxe. Sword and I have a chest. Now, if you don't remember how to make things, you can open up. You can say, Okay, I need a shield. No, can't find it. Okay, never mind. So I could open up my. Oh, I can. Okay. Make all different kinds of things. And. Oh! I did need the door. So the red ones are the ones that you cannot make yet, so that's uh, good to know. Okay, let's see, can I find a door? No? Why isn't my search working today? Oh, there it is, oak door. Yes, I can make one. Well, three, really. Okay, there we go. So I can put on my door. Hey, I will be safe. Alright, oh, I forgot to add my, I don't need to carry a door with me, so I can just place them in here, alrighty, it's getting late, so we'll have mobs coming, and I didn't see any, yeah, okay. I'll go in and sleep. So there you go, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, teachers of Ultimate Players. This is how you can get Minecraft. And let me know in the comments if you want to see how to do the Minecraft server. Uh, also, how to install Minecraft Bedrock client and i will do that in the next episodes if you so want if you like this kind of com uh, content please make sure to subscribe and comment like and that will spread the channel forward to other people as well so make sure that that is something that you are going to do whilst having fun with Minecraft. I'll see you in the next one.